Welcome back, my friends, to another YouTube video. Today is another Light to Lighten Woods that is flowing through me. Kolo kekala asomo sekinni dunu dalakala kukuma Isana sono vina akulu, ikili kukuma kana akulu isana, dunu delantana akulu ukulu, isana somu sunu, sini sunuku uku, dili doruku valuku veliki, usu suhuku makina akulu. Dili doluku matana okulu, ikana ikana okulu, fala ala fala ala alu usunuku, dili doluku valaka isa, vili voluku ulu uluku, dili doluku usu soluku. Dili doluku ukuma akala, ikili kuluku makili soluku, isi sununu matana akulu, ikala ikili uku uvalo, isana soluku dili doluku, isana kuluku gili kukulu ukulu, vili valuku uku uku, Ixena usu sini saluku. And my cats have jumped up here. Hello. <laughs> kind of startled me. You're gonna kind of. She's poking her head. Give me. Walk forward. Okay, though. He startled me. Almost. Didn't know she was gonna jump up. Why do you always jump with, up on my desk when I'm speaking light language? Like, why? I, I don't know why he does that. Uh, light language could probably just be angel, uh, the angel language. Why not? <laughs> like, no one would figure that out. Like, you think it's universal? Like, from different star systems? What if it is us? the language of the angels, but no one has figured that out. That would be something. Now that's a deep thought for today. I was feeling some, some tingles, energy flowing through me as usable, nothing too crazy. Uh, okay, wings glowing, that's good, that's good. I mean, and I am back to my normal self from the the time when I uh, descended into a lower state of vibration because I was dealing with the effects of I broke some guy's heart. That energy affects us, so therefore you just have to go through the motions, and I did. When light reached me from my guardian angels, I ascended back up away from the depressive state that I was in, even though I knew. Well, the thing was, he was like, okay, you know what? I don't, um, the plan was I was not going to date you. However, you just told me that you liked some other guy. So I felt, he felt be betrayed because of it. Once again, people lose me because I'm not on the table. I am not on the market. Sorry, not table. <laughs> I am not on the market to date. I already have a soul bond with someone. I am not going to just jeopardize that. And technically, I almost did and I was heartbroken from it. So I'm like, oh, so that makes sense of why... I designed this personal hell for me because of what I did all those eons ago, but I completely forgot until it just smacked me in my face. It's like, oh shit, now this makes sense. Like, why people try to, quote, 
trick me away. It is the journey of trying to find your twin flame. You will therefore try many different people until you find the right one. And even then, you're like, okay, one more person. I almost did that one more person and jeopardized everything. I was like, no, 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 no. I mean, well, why did I do that? So I guess I'm, the light language for today was I was still healing that uh, what I was feeling, even though, quote, I was innocent because I forgot what the hell I did in the first damn place. Why are people tricking me? I don't know. Because I didn't, I don't know. I, I didn't remember until this hit me. It's like, oh, meaning by hit, it was shown to me. It's like, okay, now everything makes sense. Why this is literally my personal hell. It's just mind blown when you wake up fully and know the truth and resonate with it. Things come alive. Things start to speak to you. Like, uh, like, uh, okay, for example, what if some guy came from the future, okay, he saw a face from a Greek statue or Egyptian, whatever. It's like, you know what? I'm gonna make this part, this, clone this body, clone this face, okay, and I'm gonna be a rock star supermodel whatever and and it's like no one figured that out like okay you have evidence hello is like cloned a face and no one has figured that out it really like how how do you not like realize that like are, why how, how do you not know or check this out the same eyes reappeal throughout history no one realizes that they say the eyes are to the soul it is true and Actually, it comes to back to back to that one movie that I that I watched about the eyes. This this guy was looking for his girlfriend that he he loved, and she dies. She came back. He was looking for her again. Only thing is, he went by the eyes. Finally found her, based on the eyes alone. Mind blown. I mean, what if that is a type of reincarnation? Your eyes come with you. Your body just changes. And your eyes stay the same. But no one has figured that out. Like, mind blown. But seriously, go through history, find eyes, compel. Through, you will find the same eyes throughout history. What if it is the same soul? And that is why the eyes are the same, just a different body. It, think about that, but no one has figured that out. I mean, it could be a possible ability that is reincarnation at its finest. Or say, okay, how about this? I died, came back, and I know things that no one else knows. Like, for example, uh, th there was this theory about uh, something about in Egypt, and this archaeologist goes to this one spot, says something is healed, they dig, and guess what? They found something there that no one else knows about because that person from that era, well, it was, came back and told the people to dig here to find it. What if that is reincarnation at its finest, but no one knows? Like, wait, are you, are you trying to tell me you're a psychic? No, I'm the same soul, duh. But, but no one, like, knows. Like, no one has figured that out because it is a well-kept secret hidden in plain sight. Maybe that is the, um, uh, Buddha keeps coming back as a new person. No, wait, that was the Dalai Lama, not Buddha. Whoever it was, something about China kept him locked away or something. I, again, a theory because they don't want it to escape into the public. But what if it is the same soul? You just don't know until your eyes are blown wide open and resonate with it on upper metal dimensions because Earth is just, Earth is hell. Like, literally, we are on the lower spectrum of everything except if you came from 9D or you came from metal dimension to, to 3D, you forget. Therefore, you are an extended master already, but you have to remember that. 
And that's what I'm kind of getting right now from the light language is like saying, hey, what if you're an extended master who is a slave but has to get thrown the tests to wake up? What if? Oh, wait, that is true because I've done that. I am living proof that I am an extended master from 9D, came to 3D, forgot everything, and wait, sexuality, I was an angel all along, and that is why the demons was my abuse. Makes perfect sense, because the demons tried to keep me in hell. Me, my soul is literally screaming, I need to go back up, I need to go back up, like, come on. And so it's fighting evil, because it does not resonate with it. Hello? But the demons are literally trying to manipulate me, but it failed because I could see through them. My soul somehow see through it before I woke up. What if there is no night of the soul? What if that is not the case? What if it is something else? Just you literally waking up to know, hey, you know what? I'm not human. I must be an alien because this world I do not resonate, resonate with. This world is alien to me. Why am I being abused all the time? Oh, it must be because I did not come from here. I must be an angel. Or, yes, any there was only angels and demons in this world. If you know what I'm talking about. And, and that's what I'm, I'm getting from the light language today is saying to you wake the hell up you're an angel not a human not a demon if you are not into devilous things aka murder for instance heinous crimes demons will think on low terms manipulation if you rose above that you are therefore an angel in your light just lost. Whoever you resonate with is a kindred spirit. Evil cannot love. See, see the problem? They think you can love everything, everyone. No, evil is in, it has not, evil can never love. Evil does not love evil. If you get what I'm trying to say, angels love angels if you know and you believe you are following angels uh, like guardian angels uh, par uh, people who have died and come back in your dreams guiding you spirit certain spirits um, certain familiars who are guiding you into the light keyword into the light you are an angel you just don't remember that you are an angel who descended from heaven to guide mankind in secret. Now you're waking up and trying to find other angels to wake them up, which is what I am doing. Finding my own tribe, which is again angels, because all the star seeds, different races, are fantasy because this is a role play game we just forgot we were in virtual reality literally think about that what do you think the different why, why do you think all the different races came to be imagination duh think, think about that for a moment we are in another body this is our avatar we just forgot we were angels. We were the old gods, therefore, and the demons keep us here, trapped us here. Well, actually, that's another story hidden in plain sight. No one has really figured that out. So in theory, the demons trapped us here for all eternity until we decide we do not resonate with this evil. We got out of this evil. We pushed the toxic people back. We keep them under lock and key. We ascended into 40, into 5D, rising our light back into upper dimension, middle dimension, because our soul 
is remembering we are light beings. We are light beings. Demons hate us for our light. They are parasites trying to feed on our warm blood. Therefore, they will do anything in their power to keep us here. It is our job to, therefore, wake up to find our other angels and wake them up so they know what the hell is going on. Earth is a living nightmare, a living hell. And when you start to see through that, that is the actual matrix right there. When you start to see, hey, you know what, why this world is in chaos? Because it is hell. You see through things. You wake up more. You remember because you were an angel the whole time hidden in a human body. The gods, the old gods, never left. They were here the whole time. We just never knew because we were asleep the whole time until we remembered, woke up, and felt our light or found an angel who woke us up, Rem reminded our soul, hey, you don't resonate with demons because you were an, were an angel the whole freaking time. Now wake up, literally. And that, and that is what I'm sensing the light language for today is expressed in. I don't know really what I said, but it's kind of what I've been resonating with the past uh, days. When I, boom, woke up completely. I'm still being reminded of what I really resonate with, um, which is again light beings, uh, hidden, hidden guardians, uh, um, the watchers, the, the uh, fairies, elves. Uh, they go by many, many names. Even, again, vampires, we think of vampires as evil, but what if they were, quote, killing the bad men all the time, killing demons, not innocent people, but evil people? What if? I mean, then that would make complete sense, because why would a vampire... Why do we think vampires are demonic when, in fact, they were not demonic? The demons made us believe that. Think about that for a moment. I thank you for your time, and until we meet again, my friends.